That's not the only party going on right now. Five News reporter Micah Wilson picking up our team coverage in Fayetteville. Micah, you've been down on Dixon Street. No need to go to San Francisco. They, this, these, this, these fans brought the stadium to Fayetteville. Across the state, but right here on Dixon, I mean, the bars don't close until 2 a.m., so fans are still here, still celebrating, still calling on the hogs. Fans guessed it. Hawks taking the win, but when it came to predicting the final score. Winning by four, 72, 68. I'll have us winning by like five. Off a bit, but final score 74, 68. Some fans at a loss for words. You can't, you can't describe it. While others have a mouthful to say. I should have played, that's all I gotta say. Oh! Eh, eh, eh. Oh God. Hawks taking the win. Only SEC team to go to the Elite Eight. I mean, you know what I mean? Gotta, take it Come on. You and now they'll be cheering on the Hogs to the Elite Eight. Who is it better than the Razorback Hogs? Ain't nobody. nobody. Ain't nobody, nobody got better than the Hogs. Having high hopes for the team. I'm telling you, Must Bus is going to take it all the way. I, I swear. I put it in my bracket, too. I got to say, yeah, it's Wolf Big. Say, say, and I love the Hogs. Elite Eight, baby. Darren, talking about some excited fans. I mean, each time the Hogs scored, they. Room exploded with cheers inside JJ's. We were there. Everyone had on their Razorback red, ready to support the Hogs. And now they're going to support them in the Elite Eight. For now, we're live here in Fayetteville, covering news where you live. Michael Wilson, 5 News.